So I wanted to show you guys what you can do with a basic ring subscription. That's what I currently have. And I don't even have it on all of my cameras. I only have it on one. Well, actually, but we'll, we'll probably update it soon. But anyways, um, just to show you what you can do with a subscription. Now, do you need a subscription for a ring camera or a ring doorbell? I don't have an alarm system, so I can't speak to that. Uh, but with a camera and a doorbell, the answer is no, but the answer is really you probably should have one because you know a big reason behind having these smart cameras and doorbells is being able to record things that happen around your house when you aren't there or maybe you are there you just need to record it so i'll show you exactly what this looks like so currently um my front door is the only one that has a subscription right and what that means is it's a basic plan it is going to record these video clips and save them into the app. And that is really all you get with a basic ring plan, right? So I have all of these different recordings of things happening in my ring system. What's that? Yep, that's the mailman. Mailman's coming through and it is going to hold those recordings. I'll show you what happens or what it looks like. So this is my back. Don't judge the yard because it's a mess. We go so i don't have a ring protect plan on this camera so it's not going to save any of the uh, motion alerts or uh, recordings from this camera but i can still go live and see what's going on back there right so again like i said do you need a subs subscription no do you want one probably so i have this camera right here so it looks all crazy we won't worry about that um so let's go over here and look at the protect plan so select this here we go so like i said front door is covered by the basic plan which only includes the recording and i have two devices here that are not covered and to upgrade to the next level you get all these extra features, which is cool. And I probably will do now that I've shown you guys. I don't have, well, I have ADT on top of this, so you guys can't get me. Um, and plans can't be managed in the Ring app. And that's mostly because Apple is gonna charge Ring, you know, 30 or 40%, whatever ridiculous amount that Apple's charging, uh, if they pay, take any payments through the app. So you do have to go to the ring.com um, account. As far as the pricing, Let's see. Okay. So as far as the pricing, you're going to get the basic for $4.99 a month or $50 a year. And the plus would be $100 a year. So I don't have this. So I can't speak to that. I wonder how many devices this is for all your ring doorbells and home cameras at one location. Okay. Yeah. So... $50 for one or two or three or four or however many cameras you have or $100 for the same thing. Not a bad deal, I think, and especially if you're only paying annually. So, um, again, highly recommend getting the Protect plan. Uh, do love Ring. Love the app. I think it's better than a lot of the competitors out there. Um, but, yeah, guys, I hope this is helpful. If you could like the video, subscribe to the channel. See you next time.